Hey everybody, welcome back. This is Cassie with Sassy Cassie Plans, and today I'm planning in my day planner for the week of January 17th through the 23rd. And today I wanted to use journaling and winter wonderland um, from the book Posh. I have some of these left over that I didn't use from my vertical spread that I did in December. So I wanted to see if I could fit these in. So for this layout, um, I do a lot of writing, so I try to put more boxes than decoration in here. So I'm running low on boxes and I'm really kicking myself that I didn't um, buy any of Mojo Jojo Plans sticker books. I really should have, but I wasn't ready to spend all my money on those at the time that they came out. So maybe next time she releases some, I'm definitely going to try and get some because I'm really in need of boxes. But I do have journaling doodles and I wanted to use some of these boxes and these maybe. Or I could use some circles. I'm not sure. Okay, let me get my wax paper. I'm gonna grab my Namby sheet that I use to place extra stickers that I have. I know I definitely want to use these. Maybe this one. Maybe this one. Should have just taken the whole sticker pages out, shouldn't I? Okay, I like this one. And maybe this one. Okay. So I'm going to put this to the side. We have these stickers. Now I just need to decide what boxes I want to use. I could use some hexagons. Mm, I think I'm just going to stick with the boxes I originally planned. So I'm going to grab a few of these. I'm trying to decide how many I need. This should be good though. Let's see if there's anything else. Maybe I can add these on the top. They're a little big though. Maybe not. Oops. Oh, since I am doing journaling doodles, I do want to put these numbers on the top just to give it the same vibe. So this year, for my faith journal, or my faith planner, um, I have this Bible app, and... They have devotionals on there, and they have this section where you can choose um, a certain emotion or a feeling like stress or anger or hope or grief, stuff like that. So um, I wrote a plan out, and each month I'm going to focus on one of those. So this month is stress. So each week I'm going to be doing a different devotional that has to do with stress. And um, what I can, and it can help me to figure out what I can do to focus more on God and what He can do for me rather than what is out of my power and learning to give it to Him. So I think that's perfect for this month because boy, has this year not started out well for us at all. 
my fiance got COVID at the beginning of this week. So I've been running around like a chicken with my head cut off, trying to um, run the household, keep all the kids occupied and happy and everyone fed and the house cleaned and sanitized on top of all that, hoping and praying that nobody else got sick. So yeah, it's been a wonderful week in this household. So yeah, um, I think it was just a perfect decision and it all will work out. We had managed to stay COVID free the past two years and it was about time it finally hit us. So the only thing I'm worried about is that it's the Omicron variant. So it's supposed to be super contagious and yeah, I'm just really hoping that we were able to get him quarantined in enough time for us to not have caught it. I think I want to put this one right here. I kind of want to put a box right here just to put in the name of the devotional that I'm doing. So let me see. Wait, I might want to do January. In this as well. Let's do a smaller one. Okay. Mm -hmm. I don't know if I want to do a circle. We can do this. This might work. Let me put this one off to the side. Okay. So I'm going to place my biggest stickers down first just so I can plan around them. And then I'll layer this other big box over here and cover up observations though. I don't really go by what these titles are, so most of the time I end up just covering them up. Okay. I'm just going to place these remaining remaining boxes around the page. And then I will do my decorating around it. Okay. Have this little thing right here, so I think I might add it up here in this corner and layer these over it. like so, just to get a little dimension to it. I also have this, I think they're cookies, along with the cat hair. Okay. Mm, I don't know how I feel about it. Okay, I also have this big Big one I don't know what to do with. So I might look up there. Okay. Now for these, I kind of wanted to bring these along the edges of the page just to tie in some of the colors. But first, let me put this stuff down. Since I know for sure this is where I want this to go. And then I want to think about what washi tape I want to use. I just feel like washi tape just like brings the whole spread together. Oops. 
the lines kind of showing through it. So I'm going to use my Uniball Signo and kind of just wipe that out real quick. Okay. Washi tape. Let's just go with... We'll just do some grid. And the line will separate at the edge here. And then I think I'm going to end up whiting out this line. Just since it's a white sticker, I can see through it. So I'm going to use my Tombow correction tape. I kind of went too far on that. Trim these edges off real quick. Okay. Cute so far. There and then I'm going to layer these ones first. Let's see if I can get it down. too far over. Okay. Let's just cover up observations. Okay. I think that's where I had it originally. Just lift this up real quick and do some white out. Okay. And then Add the spots a little lower. Cute. Okay, I need to add some washi, and then we definitely need more blue on this page, on both pages. I feel like that space needs a little something. Maybe this would look good behind it. Just a little pop of color. I'm not sure if I like it though. Oops. I do like this though. Where I could connect them like I did this one. But then that takes up a lot of my writing space for Tuesday. I think it would be really cute if I added some pops of pink as well, but I don't know if I have boxes that would match good enough. I'm just going to add this in the corner, and then we'll add it in some more places as well. Let's see how I want to cut it. I'm sorry if I was out of screen. I'm still trying to get used to looking at my phone and make sure I haven't migrated up on the page, so I apologize if that was out of frame. Okay, so that looks really cute right there. 
I know I want to add some more. Maybe I can do some. I want to add some more of this down here. So I'm going to use the scraps and just continue it along the side. Okay. I think I want to switch them. I don't like the way that this one just stops since I cut it all on that side. And then I also don't like how this is so thin. I'd rather it taper off on the other side. So switch them real quick. I like that a lot better. Okay, let me put this one back over here. Okay, that looks better. Okay, I think I'm about done with my wax paper, so I'm gonna move that. And let's finish up this spread. We need to add some more washi tape in a few places. And I think here would be really cute. Gonna snip that off. Down here would be a good spot. Okay, so I have this left. I need to figure out where I'm gonna put stuff. All right, I think this will be cute right here. Just gonna layer underneath the box though. Okay. Hmm. So I definitely want to use this because it's one of the last stickers that I have from that set, and I don't know when else I would use it. So we gotta figure out a place for it to go. It might be cute down there. Okay. Maybe I could put the rest like right here. I'm just going to need to punch out the holes, which I hate doing, but it'll be worth it. I'll just add these cookies over here. Or I have this one. But I think I'll just add those there. Okay. I'll punch that out when I'm done with this spread so you don't have to watch me struggle with trying to get that accurate. And this one, I think I might as well just put it up here. Okay. I'm just going to cut it off. I'm not going to worry about connecting it to the other side because there's not enough decoration left so I think that is gonna be let me know what you think about it I absolutely love these pastel winter colors it 
I've been obsessed with them this winter season. Um, let me know what you think about it. Um, leave a comment down below and a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you all have a great day. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.